What can we learn from athletes about focus? Work and home had an element of apple cart upset in 2020. Work and life merged so drastically, the idea of the two being separate was severely challenged. Yet people found ways to manage the distraction and to focus. What did it take to do that? Competitive athletes can give us a clue. Iowa Rays gymnast Sean Johnson East exemplified what it takes in her events at the Olympic Games of 2008. Watching her get ready to compete on the balance beam was telling. After Sean powdered up her hands, the camera focused in on a clear shot of her face. It was impossible not to see the combination of focus and determination there. Although she was in an arena with thousands of people, she was clearly not in the noisy, stressful space at all. Her look communicated there were only two things at that moment she was present with, the balance beam and herself. The National Academy of Sports Medicine explains this ability. For most athletes, the more fatigued they become, the more they tune into distractions. For example, the crowd, the coach, other things happening beyond the competition or their competitors. The more an athlete focuses on distractions instead of performance, the more this will increase a sense of fatigue, anxiety, lack of focus, and a lack of concentration. It's important for athletes to think about what they are doing in the current performance setting rather than how they are feeling, particularly about something outside of the competition and many times outside of their control. Ian Palumbo, an elite sports trainer, states, the present moment is the only time that an athlete, or all humans for that matter, can execute. Yet we spend so much time dwelling on the past or the future. One could argue many distractions went away during the pandemic as life became focused on staying in and staying well. Yet new and unfamiliar distractions emerged as we coped. We were presented the opportunity to do what the athletes do, to stay focused and present in order to perform whatever we had to do to the best of our ability. In that respect, the conditions of the pandemic gave us a powerful lesson.